Hi guys, part one. This is Amy. I'm Amy. I'm Amy from Amy's a little bit of everything. How you doing? I'm doing all right. Jazz hands, silk flappers, fishy lips, and butterfly. If you did that with me, you are young at heart. And if you didn't, fast forward that part. You didn't need it anyway, so don't worry about it. Who cares? We don't judge around here. But you might hang around. You never know what you might see or find. You know, with Timu hauls, you never know. I know there's a little bit of something for everybody. All right, I got a Timu haul. I actually got a couple, and I am sorry, but it is very humid here in Indiana. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. We've got our air on. I can't breathe when it's this humid, and I'm pretty sweaty right now. I went out to get the mail, made your mistake, came back in, lips kind of blue, <laughs> and I've been like, air. But um, we got the air on. I got my buddy. He's been outside all morning. He is wiped out already. Still got beautiful flowers that Jeff got me for my anniversary. It was um, the 11th of this month. Okay, let's dig in. Man, I'm hot. I gotta get cooled down. Okay, let me get my papers in order. Three, I think Bear was in my bag. Okay, here we go. Alrighty, first thing. Oh, I've already tried this out for you guys. First thing is this. It's called a portable. Wait, let me see it. I gotta see first. When I get these headaches and get hot like this, my vision starts to get blurred. More blurred than what I normally get. Uh, portable manual coat shaver for removing hair from clothes, sofas, carpets, quilts, pet hair. It was 17 cents. This is what it looks like. It's not, when I first got it, I thought it like had sharp edges on it or was gonna cut my couch. And really, it doesn't. Um, this is a little sharp. Yeah, I don't even think it could cut you. But when I am, I tried my couch with it and it does get anything up, lint, hair, anything. But I just feel like it's kind of hard on my furniture. Granted, my furniture is not brand new, but hold on guys, I need a paper towel. Um, my furniture is not brand new, but I don't want to get a hole in it either. Oh, I'll tell you what. I think if I had my pool up today, I think I could jump in. <laughs> oh, I, oh, gosh, I did have a, 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 a piece of candy. So don't think that's blue. From, oh, my gosh, I forgot about that. I bet you guys did think, oh my gosh, her mouth is blue. I had some blue candy earlier. I just meant blue for my lips because I get a funny blue color on my lips whenever I get short of breath. But this is candy. <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to stick my tongue out that far. Forgive me. This is not professional, Amy. All right. Sorry, I'm having one of those days. Probably a hot flash day. Um, but yeah, I really like this. And for 17 cents, I thought, heck, I'll give it a try. I also have one chair when I first got diagnosed with my disease. There was months where I didn't get out of that chair and I was freezing and just a whole bunch of stuff going on. And they started me 40 milligrams of prednisone and a high doses of medicine. Oh, I had never felt so bad in my whole entire life. Granted, I've never been sick before this. So I didn't know what it was to be sick. I'm a nurse. I'm a registered nurse and I, I took care of sick people, but I never knew myself what pain and sickness was really about because I had never been sick. So this, that was all new to me. But anyways, what had happened, I had sit in that chair and I, I had to put a blanket in the recliner because I needed that softness, that warmness. I don't know, my skin was just, oh, it was awful. I mean, sar sarcoidosis can affect your skin, your nervous system, everything, every organ in your body. And I was at a flare high. Um, so when I got better, I took that blanket off there and I had all these little nubbies on there. And I'm slowly but surely getting them off there. But now I tried this little thing. It was so fast. I'm going to get them off completely. And that's been, they've been on there, uh, well, a couple of years, probably two and a half years. And I mean, I got them pretty much cleaned off, but there's still some little hard areas that I'm just like, oh, forget about it. I'll just get it later. And, um, but now I can go through there and get them kind of like tight areas and stuff. But for 17 cents, why not? Why not? All right, let's see. Then I got, oh, I got these cute little, I don't know if I could leave my trash open or not. 
Sometimes if I leave it open, you know who tries to get in it. He may not, because he's pretty worked out. He's hot. The house is nice and cool, guys. It's just me. I get these... And they're not even, I mean, it's not a menopausal hot flash thing anymore. I'm past that. It's um, just my thyroid with my disease and everything. I'm a mess. Um, but it's these little clips, <laughs> they just have like this little, oh, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but just got these little um, pink things on there. Um, just a little designer thing. I don't know. I saw them. You get four of them. And I said, hey, I gotta have those. So I got them. So there, they were 17 cents. Why I didn't get more? I don't know why. Um, and then I got these little measuring tapes. I always throw, oh my gosh, I throw these in my purse. I put them in the car, put them in Jeff's truck. Now granted, yeah, Jeff don't need it in his truck because he's got his in there. But they're just the cutest little things and they come in handy. And I mean, if you're out and about and you gotta measure something or you wanna measure something at home and, or get to Lowe's or something, I've been there before and I'm like, oh, I know it's like 13 inches, but how far will it look on this 13 inches? So I can get it out, look at it and voila. I just love those little things and they were 55 cents. So I grabbed up a couple. Then where, 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 where is my stuff at? There's another one of those little measuring tapes. I got a couple of them. I just love those little things. Okay, I am looking for... Oh, there's another one. Okay, I guess I, I, guess I got four. <laughs> oh, here they are. These little bows. I love these bows, and I love having them at home. I usually get my bows from the Dollar Tree, and they have beautiful ones for $1.25. Um, oh, gosh, I don't know if I can get just one of these out. Okay, I got a yellow one out. Did I get one or two? And you get 40, 40 pieces of rainbow collar. You, there's eight collars in there. They're small size bows, but for 40, I paid 71 cents. Now let's see if I can do this. And I mean, it's kind of nice. Okay, you, here's your bow. And then inside there's gonna be these two little strings. And you just pull on those. Gently, gently, hold on. Oh, I think you gotta start like that. And you just keep pulling on them till eventually, well, we scared I'm gonna mess one up. I don't think you could mess one up. I mean, yeah, you could pull too hard and, okay. And then, there you go. And then I just tie this off. You could tie that around your package if it's small. And if not, cut them off and just glue it on or tape it on. I didn't mean glue. But, I mean, you get 40 of them for 71 cents. I didn't think that was bad at all. And then you just pull that right back out. And there it goes. And they're really pretty. I'll hold them up, but I won't take them all out because I know all you guys, have, you probably have seen these before to get that one back in there because I want to put this all back in my um, wrapping stuff. Okay. They come like this in a nice little package and see all the colors. I mean, there's everything in there. Blue, green, purple, light blue, pink, red, peach. A wide variety of them. So I thought for, what I say, 71 cents? Yeah, 71 cents. Can't beat it. Then our numbers on our mailbox is looking really bad. So they're like this and they'll glow in the dark, or not glow in the dark, but when a car hits them, they reflect. So I got these and they were $1.43. And so I'll give those to Jeff now and have them put, or have him put them on our mailbox. All right, now you guys are gonna crack up. You know I've, Started getting out the wig things again. And I just can't seem to find right now anything I like. So I thought, well, maybe I just need bangs. I've been watching people wear bangs. <laughs> All righty. Here we go. Okay. Well, I had this idea. Okay. Here's the gray. And as you see, it does not match me. <laughs> oh, 
Gosh, how do we put these in? Okay, yeah, I thought they were like snap or something. If I can get it off, okay. All right, so now see, I just, okay, now hold on, bear with me. It's gonna look goofy there for a minute. Like maybe I, oh no, not that. See, I just, my hair's not cut for this. Okay, now see, if I had my bangs, say if my bangs were straight down. <laughs> my hair's too fluffy today because it's humid out. Um, but I wanted some side things here. <laughs> okay. Well, that's not good enough. Okay, you know how I have the dark in the back? Well, I thought, what if I get gray? <laughs> I look funny. <laughs> Gray, okay, I think it would, oh yeah, oh no, okay, this won't look at it all. <laughs> oh my gosh, I hope Jeff don't come in. Okay, guys, this just absolutely <laughs> did not work out right. Could you just see me going somewhere with these bangs? I know you guys are going to be like, just grow your own bangs. Um, now see if I mix them, hold on, I got to mix them. Don't judge yet. Yeah, see, these have got to be, okay, I need them switched around. But now, see, with, okay, maybe there's no way to fix this. <laughs> I just wanted to give you guys a laugh. All right, you haven't had a laugh in a while, have you? Um, okay, now they're stuck together. Okay, um, but I was just thinking, you know, if I blended them, they would kind of like, like, look like, the back of my hair but yeah no I don't think so guys I look like a cartoon character okay now hold on now let's get this okay now see this would all be styled differently I would have <laughs> okay maybe not now see we gotta blend this in blend it blend it oh gosh I hope Jeff don't come in he's gonna be like okay Amy has really lost her mind. And what if I even like just tuck that back there. See if I can fluff this up, put a little curl in there. Yeah. I'm trying. And I don't even need bangs. I don't even need hair on top of my head. I've got ow. And then if you get it stuck in there, there maybe I can do <laughs> But, see, I got plenty of hair up there. I don't need bangs, but, you know, it's just one of those things. You just think, what if I, you know, mix some colors in there or something? And I love the little wispies there. And maybe if I had, like, maybe all this, like, put back and then maybe some eggs. I don't know. And see, the gray don't even match. And, again, you guys would tell me it's too shiny. Do something about it. So, yeah, okay, no. <laughs> Ellen. Do you want me to send these to you? Ellen is my beautiful sister that she so graciously, grace, gracefully, I don't know if that's the word I wanted to use. Um, she takes my stuff and I'll say, Ellen, I have some wigs for you. But she also has a bunch of granddaughters that plays with the wigs. And so I love sending her my stuff because I can just imagine those girls playing with it. Okay, so I put them back on their little clips. They got really nice clips, but yeah, I just don't think this is a go for me. I'll just do the whole, you know, wig thing. Now I've got hair hanging oh, off of me, and now Jeff will come in and be like, whose hair is this? I'll be like, I don't know. Just leave me alone. I'm hot, and I'm hot, and putting that wig on me, not a good thing. Not a good thing. Oh, the bangs, though, the, oh, they're both 98 cents. So, I mean, honestly, guys, and honestly, like I'm telling you, now the gray has a little funky shine to it, so you'd have to dull it up some. But honestly, if your hair was this color, this is beautiful. This looks real. I mean, I'm not down in the hair or anything. I mean, it's soft, and oh no, the hair is beautiful. And if you had um, this color of hair to where you had the right cut for bangs, this would be awesome. And for 98 cents, I'd go for it in a heartbeat if it would fit my hair type. Now, if I let my hair go to a, like a little bob, I doubt if I do, guys. This is just too cool for me and too easy to do when I'm not feeling well. But if I do, 
that would be cute with a bob. You could, even if you didn't have bangs, say your hair was all one length and you wanted to add a little bang in it, those would be beautiful. And I'm not down on them in that way. I'm just down on them because they look funny on me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I will be the butt of all jokes. All right. Here we go. And then I got these socks. I wear these. <coughs> I wear these kind of socks all the time. Great. Now I got long black hair on me now. Um, but yeah, I'd wear those bangs in a heartbeat if I had the right cut. I love stuff like that. And I'd put a clip in it and make it really cute. But, um, on, on, um, Sunday when we went to church, I needed just a little sock like this just to put on with my slip-ons. I got light beige, white, and black, and they were all 87 cents. And they look like this. And these have, which I like the little grippers on the bottom. I will probably go back and buy some more of these. Because, oh, they even have the grippers around the... See, they got this little gripper that sticks on your feet. But I love the lace ones because um, they just look so pretty um, around your foot and your shoe. Now, sometimes my shoes, they won't show. But a lot of them, they do. The little lace around the... Like around here will show. But that's the foot part. And then it's got that little bottom skid thing. But um, I just take these and I put them. I wish I could remember each time to put them in there like this. But I don't. I take them like this. And I just do, you know, one of those things with it. Keep it all twisted up. <laughs> and that's them. And like I said, they were $0.87 cents each. Then I have a bunch of these around. But I um, don't know what I did with some of them. And I know I got them around. But they're just ring sizers. Um, I don't really need one now for me. But I do have some people that will be buying paparazzi or maybe some rings off of me or something. And they'll ask me, can you take my ring measurement? And I say, well, yes, I can. So I couldn't find mine the other day. And I'll be doing events. Um, I'm doing a Mother's Day event. And um, I kind of wanted this little ring thing just in case. Because you always have people. I always have someone ask me. And it was $0.87. Cents, so I was like, I might as well just get that. Alrighty. Because it will come in handy. And always the time that um, nobody asks me, I have one on hand. And then if I leave one at home, I'll have everybody ask me. They'll be like, do you have a ring size here? And I'll be like, no, I do, but it's at home. Of course. Now, I was a little disappointed in the fire trucks. I don't know if they had a size. I've not really looked back, but Henry will love them, so I'm not too worried about them. And they're really cute. And the door opens. Everything does what it says it's supposed to do, but they're small. <laughs> okay, I was thinking, I mean, I even put in there large fire trucks. Okay, the way it looked with the little kid playing with it, yeah. Don't ever trust those pictures, Timu. That's not fair. Um, I thought they were like this. And they might have measurements. And you know how I am. I look. I see the kid play. Oh, I got to have that. I click, click, click. And I'm done. I buy. And then I wait for it to come in the mail. Okay. But anyways. And I did pay a pretty price. But they are metal. They're not plastic. So they're a nice quality of fire trucks. I've got one. I think that's this one. And they really squirt water. <coughs> Hold on, guys. I need a cough drop. I laid one out. Here it is. I laid one out for me. <coughs> okay, I don't know which is which. Let me see what the prices are. Yeah, prices are exactly the same. $16.95. So, I'm going to show you. That was not that little kid playing on the floor. With, and now, I am an adult. I'm a bigger kid. Bigger than that little kid. But now that little kid was like three. And this this fire truck was bigger than him. Now, if there's a three-year-old that's small as this fire truck, I want to see. Which there might be somewhere, you know, I mean, average three-year-old. That's <coughs> what I want to say. Okay. But it is cute. I don't know if I want to open this up. Uh, I'm not because I'm going to, I think I'm going to give these to Henry for his birthday. Um, but they're really cute and everything, you know, it showed everything. The door opens 
And this is not the one that squirts. This one, you fill this tank up with water. And then you, I'm sure there's like a button or something that you push that blows out. I really need to see if this takes batteries. I don't think so. I didn't see where it said batteries. Yeah, I don't think so. Hold on. Maybe I will open it. Guess I'm already at 20 minutes. <coughs> okay. I may just get to the fire trucks and then have to come back. I plan to do this whole thing. Let's just open it because if you guys want to buy it. And like I said, $16.90. Um, $16.96 is kind of expensive, definitely for a kid, for a toy. I mean, not really, you know what I mean. I mean, I get him a bunch of just little things, you know, just play things. Oh, now you guys, now this is, oh, now this is heavy. This is heavy, not heavy for, you know, like a kid to carry around, but this is heavier than what I thought. Okay, so, I don't want to tear anything up. Okay, so that does pull out. And it does go up. And this is where, there you go. You push that and it comes out. And I bet, yep, I think the water goes in there because there's a little opening there. Oh, here it is. They already have a battery in it. Okay, so this is well worth it for me. Um, and especially, I, think, I don't think I paid that much. I think I had a discount. You know how I am. Um, and then, wow, that can go all the way up. And this even gets taller. But I'm going to put it back down before I tear something up. Um, the door's open on both sides. Yeah, I like it. And it's heavy. You know, it's not like a, this is metal. Now, this part is plastic. This is metal right here. But, and you get other stuff with it. You get a funnel to help you fill it up. Now, that's not bad. And like I said, um, I did not pay $16.95. I know I had <coughs> a $20 coupon off. So, I, I always wait till I have a discount or something. But these are for Henry. And they were $16.95. If you probably, I mean, I don't know if that's still the same price today. But um, probably around that price, if not more. Now, I'm not going to open the other one because it makes me too worried. I can't get it in the box. But I will be giving him these for his birthday. Let's see. What time do I got? Alrighty. And then I have... Mm, no, that's not it. No, that's not it. Maybe it's not in there. All right, then these little bags. I thought these were really cute. I really didn't know how big or anything. I just saw them and I clicked on them and I just thought, oh, those would be so cute. I don't know what for, but oh, you get three of them and they're this long. And they call them lightweight store. Oh, lightweight storage umbrella bags. That's what I wanted them for. You know how you always have an umbrella and it's wet and you never know what to do with it? I would now, I would not, I would put it in here just to store it. And then when I got home or at work or something, I'd probably take it out and then let it dry because that would mold very fast. But um, they call them umbrella bags. And I mean, you could use it for anything, which I probably will. But um, I really wanted also to use them for umbrellas. And they were 88 cents. <coughs> Then I got this little B keychain. It's your keychain purse. And it was 98 cents. It opens up and it's fabric. It's nothing fancy, but I thought for a dollar I can leave change in there. I always like leaving change in my car um, for me and Henry in case we ever need it. Um, we went to the bowling alley the other day and um, they had the pinball and all those. I could have had coins in there or ones in there. So I kind of got that for that. Then, I know you guys have seen these the anti-slip rug grips. I got me some new spring rugs that I'm wanting to put out, and they do work. I've had these before, so this is a rebuy, 
and they were 89 cents. Okay, let me see where we're at. Oh, hopefully I can get this other one done. Okay. Hmm, maybe not. I better wait. Um, let's go ahead and finish this one. And then I'll re-restart this one. All right, guys, um, that's it for right now. And I'll go ahead and finish this haul. I got a little bit more, but I got more to say than, and like I said, the other day I went over 30 minutes and it didn't take me that long like it used to, <clears throat> but I don't want to chance it. It's so much easier if I keep them below 30 minutes. So I'm going to do that. All right, guys, put a smile on your face. Put a smile on somebody else's face. It's a win-win situation. Who wouldn't want more smiles and be keychains? I know I do, and I bet you do too. All right, guys, have a God-blessed day. Be kind, stay humble, and uh, yeah, till next video. Bye.